Hello and welcome back. We were making our way over to Coastal from Pleasant Valley and uh, got a little distracted by a wolf attack, but that's okay. I'm heading on the way to Coastal and uh, hope to explore a little bit. I'm hoping to find a couple of more axes, one or two. You know, if I have one, that's fine. Hopefully to find more ammo. I really don't need a new rifle, but ammo's always good. Beyond that, I don't have too much expectation on flies. And I think I'll be able to accomplish that goal, no problem. I imagine that wolf is probably down there somewhere. I like how they warn you by howling a little bit. But they don't give you a location. There he is. Well, I'm not going to go after that limb. There's a busted limb down there that I could grab. but um, And I do need to get a busted limb. Because uh, I need to cook some water when I arrive. But I'm not going to go after that one. There are easier ones to get. Plus I could probably break up furniture. I'm not too worried about that. So for now, let's just get to Coastal. The, I mean, the rural crossroads. I'll probably stop. I can either stop at rural crossroads or just go straight to the mines. I have plenty of time. Uh, what I might do is just get my wood and then go to the mines and then cook up the water there. Unless I'm already thirsty by that point. And then get ready to jump into Coastal again. I know I left several piles of cash in Coastal. Um, garments, food, that sort of thing. It might be worth doing a quick inventory as I go past those just to see if there's anything valuable. I really don't need to take clothes. I've got so much cloth, leather, and stuff like that that I don't need really doing okay as far as that's concerned. So I don't think I'll be taking it with me. A little bunny rabbit. And here's some wood here. Looks like just some limb or branches. I don't want branches. I want a limb. There's my rural crossroads. So I might just go ahead and grab that down limb over there and then head across the bridge and into that into one of these places here I like the um, there's a Canadian flag on one of the buildings over here and that's kind of what I used as a base for a short time so I may just do that this is a cedar limb perfect I think I can carry this weight, no problem. Thought I heard a wolf. So I'm not gonna dilly dally around here. I'm gonna go ahead and head back. Head on, make progress. Sounds like the weather will be uncooperative here soon. In which case, I am going to um, shack up here in one of these buildings. This is rural crossroads. Yeah, it is. Mailbox. Oh, well, I don't have any mail. I like it when I have mail. So, um, question being hit across and go up to the mine. Or try to make it here. I think. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and try to go ahead and get on up into the mountain and into the mine.
need to pay attention here because over that way sometimes a wolf crosses this path and he will come up all the way up to here here is my base of sorts nice little house here but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just get to the mine I had initially planned on stopping here but already a day behind in my progress so no sense in waiting don't like this approach because sometimes there's something waiting for you here at the top usually a wolf but I don't know the bear's path up in this area so there's one right there. Little wolf. Oh, there's another. Yeah, I knew this wouldn't be too easy. Let's see what these guys are going to do. Can always cut off that way too. But I'm not sure how far he'll go over. If he does a switch back, I'll go that way. Should bounce off something there. Oh, the weather's gonna get bad. Temperature's not bad, but yeah, I won't be able to see. So, yep, heading back. Is that a wolf? No, that's a rock. Yeah, I won't be able to see in this. And uh, I got lost coming down here before, so. I'm gonna make this home right now. I still need to make that water. And I don't think any of these shacks have a stove of any sort, so let me check real quick, but I don't think so. I don't think it has a fireplace or anything. Yeah, it has a stove. Um, no fireplace of any sort. do is try to start a fire here. I've done this in the past. Or I could start a fire right outside. Protected from the wind. But I don't know that I am protected from the wind right here. Might have to go around the side of the building. Let me see. Glass zero. Okay, I get it. That's fine. Enough for the night and enough for tomorrow. I think is right at about enough for a day. So this will give me one extra day. And that should work. Only 
know what? I can also get another torch out of it. That'll be helpful for the, for the mines. left I should pay more attention to the time I think I had 10 hours when I started heading over here and it took me about two and a half hours to get here it leaves me about seven hours and so I could go ahead and get up to the mine if I had two or three hours to get up there you know to get lost and look around I guess before nightfall so I'll go ahead and sleep for a couple of hours see how that looks one more hour. No. Okay. One more hour. No. Oh, now it's what? Now it's night. All right. So if it just turned night seven hours, so... Uh, how am I doing? Dry mouth. Another storm just hit at dawn. Great. Let's see. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and see how it looks. Is it bad as yesterday's? Or just foggy or what? yesterday. Sleeping like a baby, waking up every hour and complaining. as well be curing it may become important oh 
this whole day was blown. Just sleeping. You know, four hours is enough to get up the mountain and... Probably into the mine. As long as I can see, somewhat see. You know, if it's storming or something. Well, I got one percent. I should have thought of that when I walked in the door. I could have gotten two days worth. Nearly two days. Okay, weather. Cooperate. I'm still so behind. Okay, I think it's clear enough to see and travel. So I will go for it. Kind of want to collect some wood, but... Hey, what's the point of that? The weather will change again. What's that up there? A tree. Yeah, that's part of the tree. I don't think that torch would start. So, get my bow ready. Take a peek up here. See how those wolves are doing. I want to head this way, but I don't know where those guys are. There he is. Where's my arrow? Oh, there it was. Wait, oh, 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 oh. Where was it? Right. Where's my arrow? Oh, oh. There it is. Okay. Well, guess what? I'm getting harvested. And it's now night again. I'm going to do a little bit of looking. Exit. I don't want to say it's to the right here, but for some reason there's not a path that way. So I'm gonna look over this next rise and see if see if that was it or have I passed it already? What a deer! Yeah, I want to think it's up here and to the right. Like up in here. Yeah, that's it. Right there. I kind of know where it is, but I gotta follow my nose. Yeah, there's a burnt out flare I left. Burnt out flare that I left probably 170 days ago. not in front of me. So they don't ever come up in this little slot area up here.
Um, we'll go ahead and collect a little bit of wood. Be ducking in for the night, so it doesn't matter. Might need to cook a little bit of water. Depending on how things go. So that'll be helpful. Don't need a huge amount. An hour's worth of burn time. I kind of, in my head, I don't know if this is correct, but I figure an hour's worth of burn time on wood gives you about, if you're just doing nothing but cooking water, it gives you right out about a day's worth of water. And an hour's worth of burn time is about um, 10 sticks or so. Probably nine, but you know, just for errors. Call it 10 for sure. There we go. Beautiful. Here's the mine. Lovely coal I left. So we can do a fire in here, cook this up, and we'll kind of be back in the same situation we were before. Can I go ahead and eat? Yeah, I'll go ahead and eat. This is just one of those tiny pieces. So I was low on food anyway. And water. Well, I don't know. I may go ahead and travel. Do I have enough wood? So that's an hour. That's about two and a half hours. And I can do this in an hour and a half, so got plenty. Don't even need that crate. All right, sounds good. So I am going to go ahead and I think I've got plenty of these torches, so I was going to light one. They're all in about the same shape, so not a big deal. I've got 40 matches on me, and they're all going bad, so I'm not worried about conserving matches. I do wonder if that if the coal just keeps coming back, you know, it keeps respawning. Like, there's a piece. I think that other path is the way, yeah. Hey dude, how's it going? Yeah. We'll stop that. That's why I don't like picking up things with the torch. I end up swatting at it. That's back up.
feel kind of like I went in a complete circle. But no, guess not. Can't remember which way it is. It's this way. Porta potty. Should be the exit. Yeah. And this is to coastal. Yeah. Coastal. Yay. All right. So let me start a fire. I can start a campfire in the other indoor, in the other in mine. Well, that's just wrong. In the morning, I guess. These will stay in good shape. Plenty of water last night. Got one more meal out of me. Um, just now is dark time, so let's go ahead. Put that way. Let's go ahead and sleep for six. We'll do our cooking out here. I'll go ahead and get this cooked up and then um, call an episode. I'm not going to be going through coastal carrying a bunch of raw meat. Talk about a disaster.
Let's see what I can cook up about um, 0.4 gallons would pretty be good. Oh, let's go 0.6. I think we got enough time to do that. Might need to add some more. Yeah, just to be comfortable. I'll add a little more. And then go ahead and melt that. Yeah, there's a small piece. I need to go ahead and sleep in the episode. So let's do that. And um, thanks for uh, watching. Leave a like if you like this video. And leave a comment if you have any comments. And go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more. I appreciate it.